Hello Prince Charming! Yes, I promise to answer the next question from the video about how long the trip has to be for you to find a successful, good, proper match. So, I will answer you what to do next, because you're coming and meeting a great lady here, you connect, you like each other, you see um, beautiful eyes, you see future of your children in her eyes, and you want to make it work. So, the best way to make it work is to see each other again, and uh, to see each other again uh, as soon as possible. Um, within four, six, maximum eight weeks. Because time and distance are your worst enemies. So, if you want to make it work, then organize a trip to see her again in Ukraine or organize a trip for you to see each other again somewhere else. If you're European, then you can meet somewhere even in your, in your country, which is the best, because you are showing the lady your life, your home, your neighborhood. Uh, she sees what she's getting into if she continues relationship with you. Uh, Americans do not have this privilege, New Zealanders and Australians either. First of all, it's very far. Second, visas. Um, so we'll talk about visas next. But now we are talking about seeing each other again. So Americans can see in and meet the girlfriend, can see each other again, somewhere in Mexico, somewhere in the Caribbean, Dominican Republic, uh, somewhere like the Canary Islands, somewhere like Europe. Uh, but the best is not coming to Kiev to see the lady again, but the best option is if you really like the lady, if you are sure that this is your lady, you need to spend time separately from your everyday chores, from your everyday troubles, dedicating 100% to each other. You're in the hotel room with two different beds or even two different rooms or even the same beds with two different blankets and you try to see how it actually feels like to wake up together in the morning and what she looks like, what you look like in the morning and whether it's acceptable, right? So in uh, the marriage agency business, that's kind of important to make sure it works, right? <laughs> Otherwise, why trying? So, um, you are planning a trip uh, to really get to know each other, to really dedicate the time and dedicate the effort uh, that you are making to each other. Otherwise, like, don't waste your time if you are not planning to continue the love story. If you do not have the time uh, within, let's say, maximum uh, three months to see each other again, you know, the connection that you have built, uh, built will really weaken and will really lose its power. And very few couples really made it work when they met each other first time and then, then they married a year after. That's a mission. This is like almost impossible. We are human beings. Well, dolls are somewhere else in marriage agency in Kiev. I'm giving you the real person for having great life together, for having children with each other, for building great and happier future than you can live alone, right? So when you see each other again, then you will understand everything that you need to know about each other and you will uh, survive some stresses, you will survive some happiness uh, and moments of, of great time and then you'll know whether it's your person. And uh, still, the worst case scenario, as I say, coming back to Kiev, when you are not sure that this is your girl, when you want to spend more time but not dedicating 100% of uh, time to each other. Maybe you want to see some other people. Maybe you have some more friends and you want to take your space and just watch what is going on. But the lady will not be dedicating 100% of her time to you either um, because she has work, she has family, she has everyday chores uh, and um, probably, unless you really agree about this, that you are coming to see only her and to do nothing else, then you can even suggest to her to move in with you and stay in the rented apartment mm, that uh, you are getting to really experience life together. It will be 
a little bit more complicated uh, than uh, traveling somewhere uh, far away for her because she will still be connected to her life issues, uh, everyday things uh, here and it will be a little bit, I would say, less romantic, but still possible, why not? You need to do, use all the chances, uh, specifically if you want to meet her family, uh, meet her friends or her relatives, if you want to spend uh, more time in Kiev rather than just making two weeks. So the choices are yours. I'm giving you ideas. It also depends on the budget. It also depends on the time availability. It also depends on the personal uh, uh, psychological type of people uh, on how much closeness you can tolerate and, and so on so to summarize it well Ukrainian brides <laughs> not waiting for somebody who will be writing letters for years they want reality they want a family so after making a trip after finding a great lady you're interested to meet again within minimum four weeks maximum three months spend quality time together uh, either in kiev or in any other convenient country for both of you and get to know each other ask serious questions and learn uh, the perspectives for the future then we will have a new family, we will celebrate a new wedding. Because usually smart people, they mate, they get together and it's fun. <laughs>